Welcome to the show. And uh, this is Chef Ben Extra. Basically, we're going to be running uh, a few chats, yeah? Chat, and we'll be discussing a little bit of a training, training news, basically food training news, and uh, lifestyle, fashion, and all that. And we're here in Kira. We're going to be talking about a few things that's actually happening uh, in the last few minutes or few hours. And we're going to be talking about record breaking as well on this episode. It's an episode of Chef Ben Extra. I'm going to be giving you this every single day. And I'm having, I'm blessed to be having a very great prominent engineer on my brother and basically he's a foodie you need to really uh follow up find out what he's, he's talking about about food yeah he loves food he's an engineer who loves food and i'm here introducing you my brother uh oceans welcome to the show thank yes, you very much thank please. you just been uh, yeah sure glad to be here with you sure uh it's such a wonderful uh moment yeah to share some time with you with one of the best gifts <laughs> in the country yeah uh, by that people follow you so much okay uh, they follow you on TikTok. Okay. I, I see so many of your videos coming through okay um you take a lot of my time yeah true <laughs> uh, to see what you put up there I appreciate yeah so appreciate. this is um i'm gonna to be here sure to share uh, uh, a, a bit of a lifestyle training mm. moments with you, mm. especially about food. Okay. Um, I'm called uh, Oceans Ganga Edi. Mm. I love what I do and I do what I like. Okay. Thank you very much. Sure. And we happen to be having our amazing sponsor of this episode, and it's called Sat Electronics. And uh, basically, it's his brand. Yeah. It's his brand, and he's the biggest sponsor of our show. Please, if you are in uh, Kolambido, have check out that. You need electrical installation, you need cameras, you need whatever you need as an electrical. Look for such electronics. Basically, and um, we'll be discussing what is the training in the world of food, yeah? In the world of food. And I'm very excited to have this chat with my brother Oceans here, who has more diverse information on food. And uh, is a foodie by passion, right? Am I right? Yeah, very yeah, food right. by yeah. passion. So, Oceans, uh, before I go far, I want us to have a quick a very quick um a quick dig deep on uh, on a talk of um what is the training in uh in the world uh, world of food where are people are breaking records 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 every day every day and last time i checked it was bachi another time another person you're gonna let us know on what is actually transpiring and now we are very lucky that our own ugandan has broken this law give us an insight on what is happening on the three that i've just mentioned there's nothing more training than uh, breaking world record. Yeah. There's nothing more training than uh, having your own mm -hmm. do it. Uh, mm -hmm. And actually, much more interesting is someone doing it in your almost your own home area. Yeah, sure. Hometown, Hiram Municipality. Okay. Uh, very interesting mm. uh, to know that uh, the person who just broke the record. Mm. Is, is not even a, a chef. chef, a certified it's chef. It's quite alarming, anyway. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm surprised that I need to dig more into that. Yeah, yeah. Um, to see how how did she get the interest, the passion, yeah. the zeal. I mean, mm. we saw her serving food from Saturday. Yeah. For the 10 p.m. when the record was started. Mm. Uh, Non-stop. non -stop. Until yesterday. Mm. Yesterday at night. Mm. So I'm I'm so inquisitive. I want to dig more into yeah. into the nitty gritty. So yes. how can someone get that mm. passion mm. And, and then involve herself and body and mind mm. without? How did she even get the team? Yeah. To work with. Yeah, sure. To, to, to break that record. Yeah. So many records have been broken in Uganda. Okay. Uh, as, um, first of all, uh, about food. Yeah. We've seen uh, last year. Yeah. Raymond Kabuna. Raymond? The Rocky biggest record, Rolex. The biggest Rolex. Yeah. Ugandan Rolex. Ugandan Rolex weighing close to 200 kilograms. Yeah. Well, actually That's 200. Huge. 200. That's huge. huge. Uh, the energy he puts in. Mm. The trials. The money itself. The money. Finance. Yeah. 5 million Ugandan shillings. Mm. Sure. That's huge oh, investment. Imagine that. That's huge now, investment. We, we are actually, we are yet to know how much as. Uh, About uh, the. Um, Mamadi. Mamadi has Mama invested. Mamadi. Yeah. Mamadi yeah. is actually called Dokas Mirembe. Dokas Mirembe, yeah. Uh, she has. Uh, she has uh, she began a culinary journey just mm. last month. Yeah, last. That's really funny anyway. She, she, she was just cooking for fun, but then she took it up and she's like, I need to break this record. Mm. This record mm. uh, is called a cooker, 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 thon cooker thon, yeah. Yeah, cooking for the longest hours yeah, yeah. as an individual. Yeah, true. It is actually one of the non -stop. most tried records in the last mm. six years. 
Yeah, we've checked the Kenyans so are most so attempted mm. record. People have attempted to break it and mm. whoever has, most most have failed but whoever has tried mm. has gone a mile soon. I was I was I was, I was last night I was listening to the Guinness World Record people. Yeah when, sure. uh, when Alan Fisher mm. broke, broke the record. The island so, guy. The island guy. Mm. They were in Japan. Okay. And now the Guinness the Guinness World Record representative said it's one of the mm. most Broken record mm. in, the in the shortest years. in the shortest time. It never lasts so long. Yeah, yeah, true. Hey, it could be close to a, a month or something. There was a Kenyan, mm. Kenyan lady, uh, Mombasa lady. Mm, mm. I forgot the name, but uh, yeah, yeah. maybe I will, I will tell you when I remember. Okay, uh, she broke it. Mm. Then a few years back, uh, then an, an Indian Indian lady mm. broke it again. Mm. Uh, then uh, Bachi, the Nigerian, the Nigerian. I was in Nigeria, but, but right? I think the Nigerian. The lady hated more bars. Yeah, sure. But she put it a lot, and uh, so many people were involved in social media yeah, and getting uh, awareness of mm. heartbreaking the record. Mm. Very interesting. And she's still in the ears of the people, yeah? And yeah, and people believe she still she still holds uh, the, the 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 ranking of, of, the, of, of the record. The record was still hers. Yeah, until sure. Yesterday, mm. when I informed me some yeah, other ways, sure. I was like, maybe I need to go into yeah. the proper about mm. this. Mm. Interesting. Mm. A year ago, mm. actually not a year, but she broke a record in May. Yeah, sure, in May. And uh, in my heart, I felt that record should not be a Nigerian record. Yeah. I I, I think one time I approached It was a prophecy. You know, sometimes yeah, you yeah. prophesy yeah, things. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I approached her and said, I think mm. this record should be in Uganda. Yeah. Uh, because I've had a conversation on that. A lot, a lot. You were telling me, man, we need to have this home. We need to have this home. Um, you know why I felt so? Uh, Hilda Bachi cooked 105 meals yes 105 uh, over the course of her breaking the record yeah and uh, when i looked at the meals most mm. of them were exotic meals yeah yeah not so indigenous not so indigenous they were easy apart from the loaf rice yeah and, uh, a yeah, very yeah. few record mm. like indigenous, the uh, mm. but then i said what if someone because you have the most diverse uh Meals. Meals, yeah. We have a full basket of uh, food here. Uh, no, we, are, we, are, we have how many tribes? Uh, quite, quite over, many. Over 120 something yeah, yeah. tribes oh, yeah, in, sure. in our country. Some are even coming up. Yeah. I don't know. Mm. And every tribe has got its own yeah, yeah. staple. Staple for untraditional. Okay. Yeah, you traditional. Yeah. So I'm like, why, don't, why, why can't someone take this up and cook staples of every tribe? Mm. In that time, you may break the world record. Yeah, record, yeah. Mm. And good enough, uh, Hilda Bachi uh, made a contemporary. She mixed, matched yeah. uh, exotic yeah. and, and uh, non exotic and, and, and non exotic mm. meals. Mm. And she prepared 128 meals mm. over the course of breaking that record. Yeah. What a record. You know, they say you cannot make two records in one. Yeah, yeah. But otherwise, mm. if you dig so deep into the details, mm. You may find that she, she's done us the most meals, the most meals, yeah, yeah, in the shortest time possible. Yes, that could be another record. I don't mm. know. If they look at that, but I'm so pleased mm. to have uh, uh, Mama D. Jokers. Yeah, then before maybe we come to Mama D, mm. let's talk about the the Raymond record before we actually dig into a yeah, fashion yeah. and uh, food lifestyle. Mm. The record that was broken uh, a year back. Mm. By Raymond. Yeah. It was an idea that it came. It was out. set. It was, it was set. It was set. Yeah. Mm. And they did all these trials every single day. Mm. They could try several times and things go wrong. Bodies break. The preparation area get messy. And these people are investing in money. What is Give funny? us an insight. What yeah. is funny is Raymond is also not a chef. He's not a chef. That is Raymond really, really is just a, He's a blogger. A YouTuber. Yeah. yeah. And the food, the food enthusiast. He has yeah. been where food is. October face. Like you are. Uh, and he has been everywhere, but. They tried a year before he broke the record mm. to prepare the biggest rolex that is weighing close to 200 kilograms. Actually, the other one was weighing uh, 285 kilograms. Wow. The first attempt. Wow. As big that was as huge. It was so huge, and they failed. Mm. But on that try, mm. it was just a blogger. A blogger. Someone who was called to shoot. So he has to go back to the drawing board. So when they failed, mm. uh, the guys were demotivated. Yes. For him, it was like, no. We have to get this down. We, uh, we must take this down. I yeah. need, I need to, because as a, as a YouTuber, I need to be part of the history. Yeah, true. And we made research. Mm. Um, 
supplier research, mm. how to do the this, area where uh, to make that record. I mean, the passion he was putting in. He got a few dimes, mm. involved himself with the people that he supposed to. Yeah, true. And then he also realized he needs a wider space. Mm. Where, where, where he planned to go to Kasokoso. Yeah, Kasokoso, yeah. Kasokoso is actually in the world. It's a small level. slum. A small slum. Okay. And uh, where, where from there, mm. that's where the record was broken. Mm. He took them four tries. Four tries, yeah. Mm. Mm. And when they find no attempts, they, 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 they succeeded. They succeeded, yeah. If you look at the story on, on, on his YouTube channel, mm. you really get yeah. attached to, to Where actually the guys are getting uh, are feeling things is impossible. Mm. Where people are actually purchasing more flour, more eggs. They're actually almost giving up. Giving up. Mm. I, 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 last time I checked, they were about, there were how many eggs? One, two thousand something eggs? Imagine. And about uh, 90 kilograms of tomatoes. Imagine. You know, and uh, and uh, the last time I checked is when they had a space where they're actually operating from. Mm. And because they underrated it, in the process mm. where the chapati actually is supposed to golden, things break down because of the white. You yeah. know, the biggest, you know what we call by the biggest Rolex? The, that was beautiful. And this is in our country. The biggest problem I have with our country is one, we don't get uh, sentimental attachment to our, yeah. our own, yeah, our own, and we have done so much spectacular moves and basically uh, very unique. In, or, uh, we are very talented when it goes to music. When it comes to food, we are very yeah. talented. Last time I was in Nigeria and I told you how things run there. We are stars, but we don't realize that we have potential. So that comes back to what you mentioned before. Uh, we need to start believing in ourselves first, yeah. and also believe in our own. Yeah, if uh, oceans has an idea on creating a mass glass or something yeah. and which is one of a kind in the world let's support this guy 